So far, a lot of the strategies have been based on global guidelines for suicide prevention and no one really understands why the rate is so high in Guyana, specific to Guyana. So the research that I'm a part of wants to understand why and look specifically into Guyana. The research involves speaking to family members and loved ones of people who have died by suicide because we believe that they hold the key information that can be used to develop suicide prevention strategies tailored for Guyana. So we would like people to contact us if they've lost someone to suicide and they feel they're able to share that person's story and we'll come to their house and we'll listen to the person's story and then after we've heard enough stories we can make recommendations for suicide prevention specific to Guyana. It can definitely bring up emotions for people and it can be upsetting. It, it's also been found that talking about the loss of a loved one can provide emotional healing and people can make better sense of the passing of their family member through talking about it. So there's potential for that, but certainly it can be upsetting and I'll be there to help them through that. I've lived here for a long time and I care about Guyanese people and because I'm studying clinical psychology, I think that this research can make a strong contribution.